Good afternoon or good evening everyone, welcome back to another Train Simulator live stream. Uh, we're going to be taking our first look at the Long Island Railroad today, you can see it over here, Long Island Railroad, New York to Hicksville. Um, well, technically it's not our first look because we have had this route for almost four years on Train Sim World, but it's the first time on Train Simulator Classic we're playing it. The route is out now, so feel free to go and get it. Anyway, I literally ju li just downloaded it and loaded up the game, so I haven't seen any of the scenarios. Literally nothing to do with it um, until now. So let's uh, let's go in and let's have a look. But yeah, hopefully everyone's all well. Let me pop into the chat. We have got... Um, oh, bloody hell, what's it doing now? Um... Hold on, we've got those shit, Lion, Damien, Quicko, Sim, NG, Convoy, Sim, uh, Lion, how you all doing? So, uh, I guess it will be on career. I'm hoping the game doesn't freeze when I'm on the menu, as Train Sim loves doing that. It loves to freeze when you're on the menu. Uh, so let's hope it doesn't do that. Uh, Long Island Road, there it is there. So, for career we get M7B and M7A. What's the difference between them? Well, you get um, two scenarios for the m 7 well, the M7, not the M7A, because the M7A is the Harlan line um, version of the M7. So, I don't know, but yeah, the M7. Um, so, yeah, you can see the M7 there, Summer of Hell on, on the clock. And then for the M7 again, Hempstead 7s on the clock, Brooklyn Baller, too early for work and Saturday stake. So, that is a total of eight scenario. No, hang on. Uh... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven scenarios and two rail fan scenarios. And then for standard, sometimes on standard you get a couple of rail fan ones. Let's have a look. Do we get anything on standard? We do. Uh, you get a rail fanner one at Jamaica. So let's uh, let's go into career and let's try and find which will be fairly suitable. Take train 717 from Hempstead to New York Penn in the morning peak. Perfect. Let's do it. Is there something going on with this route? Well, it's it's new to train sim. Why do I call you Convoy? Because your name is Convoy. <laughs> Cheers Amari. The Amari branch. Is that a place on this route? Here we are. Um, right, good morning engineer. Set up the train and pull forward into the drill track and I must say I do get this free from Dovetail Games so big thanks to, uh, well Dovetail Games for sending a key over so we can check it out and this is done by Brandon uh, who might even come in the chat I suppose at some point. Cactus Juice. Hello Ethan, how are you? Please remember that all switches in the Hempstead area are manual, so we need to set them accordingly. Okay, let's get the doors... Uh, hang on, are we in the... No, we're not on the platform. So we need to get into the platform right. Feels weird, because we were literally playing this earlier on Train Sim World. Uh, they're already set for us. Uh, yeah, they're already set for us. Yeah, that's already on. Cool. Hello, Donuts. All oh, right. Well, I just call you Convoy. Um, now we need to charge the brakes. Uh, the key. I mean, let me put this up. It'd be easier. Hold on. I'm doing something wrong. <laughs> what am I doing wrong? I'll set that to uh, maybe that. There we go. Right, uh, so what we need to do is charge the brakes. Oh, I didn't see it move for a second and I was like, oh no, <laughs> what have I done? There we go, brakes are charging. Hello, looking for locos, how are you? Hello, PC help. It is a warm one, yeah. Hicksville was your hometown, awesome. Right, the brakes are now charged. We're probably actually running on a lit time limit here so we need to be fairly quick we'll set that to dim marker lights off um, gauge lights we'll get them on a little bit we don't really need the gimbal lights on right I think we're all good to uh, get going I won't do hard off on, on here I mean I could but I won't oh and I said about the points being manual as well so before we crash and disaster strikes let's change change that I think that's alright 
Well, we might crash already, which hopefully we won't, but you never know. Oh, you play, uh, you should buy Metro North. Yeah, definitely, it's brilliant. Hey, one dollar from Ethan, much appreciated. Oh, hang on, hang on, that's not set. Don't derail already. No, we're all good, we're all good. That one is set. That one's set as well. So we got to go into there. Uh, not as warm as it has been. 40 degrees in London on Sunday, blimey. 40? I think it's supposed to be 33 here. Wow. Um, well, I guess in a way, convoy-ish. Oh, wow, look at this. <laughs> that goes down quite a gradient, doesn't it? That's quite scary. Look at that. You wouldn't want to be uh, running away down there, would you? You defeated it with your PC knowledge. Alright. So where's that horn come from there? That's not that one, is it? Where's that little one? I don't know. What we got coming to here? How you doing, Leo? Cool. Almost there. Four twenty eleven. Ah. Well, this route is set, I believe, in two periods. Actually, I think the main line section is set in twenty nineteen. So when it's only got two tracks, a bit like on TSW, and then the Harold area, so that's like Sunnyside Yard, New York Penn, all that sort of area, that's set in 2021. Hello William, I'm all good, how are you? That's quite cool, my little track there, very steep. Right, so we better change ends then, and do all of that stuff again, unless it wants us to reverse in, which would be a little bit dangerous. So let's shut this down, Um That to emergency if we can. Uh, key out. There you go. Right, now switch cabs and reverse the train into Hempstead Track 5, where we will allow passengers to board ahead of a uh, <laughs> departure 0713. We're going to be a little bit late. Oh, lovely. Uh, that's not bad, Cruiser. You will have to throw the switches manually to take us from drill track into Track 5. Well, we are going to be late on this service, so expect many negative points. But that's fine, we're good at that. Right, that's that shut down. Uh, control plus to change cabs. There we go. Right, hello Amela, how are you? Let's do that. Oh no, max, and then into forward. Charge the brakes again. <laughs> hey Gabby, how are you? How's our trip with Amanda today? Very good, very good. It was it was lovely going to the Isle of Wight. <laughs> can I bet you can be Amari? Hang on. Have we broken something? No, I think it's. No, it's already charged. What am I doing? Uh, set that to dim. Mark the lights off. Um, that should be. Should be all good. And we've got to set the points manually. Right, don't roll down the hill because that's going to end in disaster. I need to set the points manually here, so I need to set. Uh, where does it want us to go? Where's track 5? Track 5's there. So I need to change that one there. It's quite hard to see on uh, Train Sim where whereabouts, as opposed to Train Sim World. There we go. Right. Let's hope it goes. There we go. Yeah, so we're in New York on Long Island, we are. Get the instrument lights on a bit. That's all weird playing it on um, Train Simulator, though, obviously on Train Sim Classic. Which, yeah, we, we were doing this on Train Sim World earlier, which is sort of the successor to Train Simulator. Oh, already speeding. There's the negative points. How are you finding it, Amela? Yeah, I'm all good. Hang on, no, no, no. <laughs> Don't go into there. <laughs> that's not, that's not going to work. Hold on, come to a stop. It's much harder to see whereabouts you set the points on this game as opposed to uh, TSW. 
I probably didn't, William, so pop it again, mate. Hold on, quickly go back. I need to change the point. Happens all the time in real life, this does. <laughs> Going to, into the wrong bit. Right, need to go to... There, that would do, that would do. Should be that one. Right, there you go, simple as that. And if nothing had happened, in we go. You thought you'd get the Isle of Wight as the teacher ain't too good. She basically tells you to Google what things are. Alright. Oh, I thought you get I thought you said you're getting the Isle of Wight. I feel like, yeah, it's a great route. Right, is this the right track this time? Hempstead track I bet it's still not the right one, is it? Track five, be the right one. Oh my god, it's it's this is track six. We'll go back quick. Hello, Rain. Bloody hell. All right, back we go. There we go. <laughs> apologies, everyone. Apologies, passengers as well. All right, full whack. This is why I don't do a lot of shunting on um, Train Simulator. <laughs> uh, the good thing is when you apply the emergency brakes, you actually hear it apply. No crashes yet. Lovely. Hold on. Can we just go into that one? I'm sure they'd be fine with it, right? There we go. All good. What are we doing for train set? Already done it. So we're all good. We're into the right place this time. We've got like a little DNA thing and like a hacker thing on there. Lovely. No, don't speed. Bring that down. There we go. Making beans, uh, and I clap. Oh, all right. All right, finally into the right track. Anyone been on the Long Island Railroad in real life? Definitely a place I want to go in the future, New York, to travel on these things. What a good holiday that would be. Go on the Long Island and then go on Metro North. Uh, all right, convoy. Well, why would they need to do that? And the river one looks fine as it is. And that will be Tuesday we get the 484. Can't be in on it. Off to a, yeah, exactly, off to a great start. <laughs> and the bloody wrong track twice. Even in Dapper, lovely Amela. This versus the New York route on Train Simulator 2020. You can't compare the two. You just can't compare the two. Lovely. Um, quick up right. We need to change tracks again now. And change cabs, not bloody tracks. Get that on. Uh, we get the instrument lights off. Um, hello, Aaron. How are you? Uh, we'll set that to max. Key out. Emergency. And do that. Uh, got yellow cabs when I was there in New York City. Been on the Boston Metro. Metro. We're five minutes late already. You can tell I'm playing. Five minutes late already on our first bloody look at the route. Okay, engineer, please. <laughs> Minus 526. Please uh, change cabs if you've not done so already and depart when ready. And yes, the manual switches. Um, right. Key. Uh, max. Forward. Charge brakes. There you go, they're charging. Imagine if you went to the side. And... Come on, charge. I want to get going. <laughs> I doubt we're going to make up the time. So, yes, yeah, so this bit's set in 2019, so that's a year ahead of the um, Train Some World version, that is. Uh, that should be it. Right. Country Life Press next. It's got a weird that country life press. It sounds like some sort of retirement home. Country life press. Right, off we go. And what is the reason behind the name country life press? 
Is it? The first time I heard of that, I thought it was like a retirement home or some sort of retirement village. You said that, you know, if you were old in New York, you'd say, I'm going to go and live in Country Life Press. Uh, can I ask you why you brought this if it's on Train Sim World already? Uh, we got this uh, from Dovetail Games. Uh, we got a key from Dovetail to show it off. That's like a newspaper company. It does as well. Sounds good, NG. I do convoy, yeah. So you press the country. Oh, hello, there's the 30. I like the horn, though. I like that tone of the horn as well. So, yeah, we have got... Um, it depends if we're a slow, slow service, but we have got Country Life Press, Garden City, Nassau Boulevard, Stuart Manor, Floral Park, uh, Bella Rose, and then New York Penn. So it looks like we're running fast after Bella Rose. I'm not even stopping at Jamaica, Hollis, any of those places. Alright, Krazer. It is named for the publisher's Country Life Press. Well, there we go. Oh, yeah, takeaway points. Hello Jude, how are you? Bloody is just like a is like a word which isn't a swear word, so it's fine to say. <laughs> we can't swear on the stream, so bloody is the next best alternative. Alright, come on. It comes down um yeah, to fifteen. I think in the TSW version it comes down to fifteen, like halfway down the platform. No, there is a 15 there. Oh no, maybe that was like the warning for it. Well, this is Country Life Press. We are eight coaches long. But I will try and make a comparison video between the TSW and TS version of this. Oh, of course, quick eh? <laughs> Right, that's that. That's the uh, that's the six. And here we are. This is the eight. Hello, Brandon. How are you? I didn't see you have a message in the end. Did you get it working? There we go. Train's not clipping the platform, that's good. Green from Poland, how you doing, Rain? Oh, lovely cry, that's good then. Lovely William, engineering works class, go on Cathcart Circle, awesome. That's the freight one, isn't it? Oh, that minus 907 points. Dear. It's alright, it's alright. Garden City next. And we're off. So we're coming up to a 15 mile an hour limit, which will then take us round the corner into Garden City. Uh, when the Island Line 2022 comes out, uh, will we be able to be a guard? Uh, oh, hello, yeah. Um, pro probably, Jude. I mean, it's got the guard panel, so I don't see why not. I mean, the train wouldn't be able to. The train wouldn't be able to move, would it, if the door's open? So if you're controlling it via the key, the AI won't be able to go. So yeah, I guess so. And you have the PIS, so you know what time you need to leave as well. So yeah. It's going to be quite good. So that one is a red, and then that one's a green. So I don't know all the ins and outs of the signals. I just know which one means go and which one means stop. Uh, there has been. Yeah, the, I'm pretty certain the 485 and the 486 were the same thing. Just sort of the 486 having a slight difference. Sure can, Jude, sure can. 
I would love them to model the guard panel on the Electro Star. On the uh, yeah, well, on the on the Electro Stars, any that'd be good. I think that probably should be something going. Or that should be something we see with most DLCs going forwards, having the guard panel modelled. Hello, Crazy Dash. If it sort of set the bar, I guess. Let's get that up. And then into Garden City. Yes, beep beep. Here we are. FPS at the moment seems alright. It did look fairly low on this route last night on the um, stream, but I think that's just how, how detailed it is. So yeah, if we do get a low FPS, it's just because it's such a detailed route. Very detailed. Uh, I have no idea, Mr. Talk a lot. <laughs> it is third rail. So that's one of the sort of similarities. I'm guessing that's if you just held down the horn just a little bit. If you do the full whack, you know, it's like like that. But I'm guessing if you just did it a tiny bit, it'd be like that. Unless that's some sort of depot whistle or something. Uh, what type of electro star do you think is best? Uh, well, you can't really include the turbo star, can you? Because that's a diesel train. Just ignore the points. Just, just ignore them. Right, up to 70. So there's something weird with the Train Sim World version. Um, it brings you down to like 30 along this corner, or around this corner. A really low speed, for some bizarre reason. See the track speed's 50, or the signal speed says it's 70. Hempstead to New York pen, uh, yes. Now it's 70. Um, I really hope the Train Sim World 2 version gets a major overhaul scenery and timetable. That would be cool. Put it again, convoy. I don't see every comment because it's busy. How do you turn on the Train's Dead Man pedal? Uh, it would be Shift Enter and Control Enter, possibly. And if not, try Shift D and Enter D. Oh no, Control D. That's just some of the binds I know. Sometimes also shift, enter, and control, enter on the numpad. Do all sorts of little magical things. Hello, Metro, how are you? But yeah, I believe it's 45 track, well, miles of track, and it's uh, Atlantic Terminal to Hempstead, and New York Penn to Hicksville. And I believe Belmont Park's included as well. Oh, yes, a Miller. Hey, 11 months already. Cheers, uh, uh, Tez. Much appreciate it. And yeah, that's a glitch where it says it's 7 months. It's a bit weird. It does it for me as well. But yeah, actually 11 months. Much appreciate it, mate. It all does help out. And here we are. See you, Brandon. Thanks for coming in. Take care. There's a stop marker on here. Oh, we're on both sides. Lucky us. So this is track A. Uh, there's the six. Hang on. Oh, that's supposed to be for that side, must not it? That's our one. Hello, game view. TS versus TSW. What's your opinion? Well, I prefer TSW as it's the successor to Train Sim Simulator. Although, of this route, I'd say probably actually the Train Sim version's better than it is four years, almost four years newer than the TSW version. And here we are. Mark them on. Yeah, I'm taking these screenshots because I possibly I might do some sort of comparison video between the two. Just you know, screenshots from the TSW one, TS one, and vice versa. Nassau Boulevard next. Definitely does look better though. Oh, do we get a passenger? Oh, we do have a passenger view. There we go. 
What other fuse do we get inside the cab? Okay, just sort of the usual. Stuart Manor next. <laughs> Fair enough, Tez. Yeah, I don't know why it does it, but... Hammer off. See, that horn there sounds like the one we've got on the Harlem line on uh, Train Sim World on, for the M7. That's just the usual one. Up we go. What does everyone think so far, though, of the Long Island Railroad on Train Sim? Cool. Will you be getting this version, or if you haven't already, the Train Sim World version? What do you prefer? Uh, we also get in 274 plus trains later this year since we get a new station on the Long Island. Is that called Elmont? Oh, Grand Central Madison. You think it's trash? Why is that? And here we are. So at Floral Park, we join up with the main line. Still get the tracks from Hicksville. Put that down. Cool. There's a fair few stations on this route as well. I'll check the route map as well in a sec. Let's have a look. It's an older game. Well, some of these, really, well, especially this one, this one looks good. Uh, do you get Belmont Park? You do get Belmont Park. There it is there. Uh, what else do you get? You also get the first stage. Is that St. Albans? I can't remember. Oh, that's the Montauk branch. Uh, so you get St. Albans there. Um, what else do we get? There you get, I think this is the Oyster Bay branch. You get East Williston. Uh, anything else extra? Have another. Oh, and you get a station here as well, Richmond Hill. I swear I just had a guard buzzer. Oh, there we go. Right, let's go. Floral Park next. Hello, Carl. How are you? The scenery is way more accurate. Yes. Oh, I'll see you, Mella. I can sort of take a guess at that because it was Grand Central in the name. The sounds are much better, that's for sure. There we go, let's get back in. Get that up. Lovely. Well, that's one of the older routes, isn't it? Crazy Dash, so that's why. At 30? So that's why I never bloody go on the outside of the train. Things start going on, it's like, uh oh. Well, they're all good though, didn't bring us to a complete stop. 30? What are we waiting for? Or is it just slow? I think it might just slow. I did it, Daniel. You, Someone noticed, yes. You should have trained some World 2 versus. Oh my. G yeah, don't worry. Yeah. I trained some World versus Train Sim Classic stream. Um, there's not really any need to, really. Everyone knows this game's the older one, so there's not, not any need to. Yeah. Although, for this route, I might do, like, um, you know, take screenshots and sort of just say which one. Compare them. Yeah, there you go. Still 30. I better check the signal. Oh, another train. That's an M7. I wonder if we're seeing M3 as a DLC on this route. Oh, but yeah, possibly. Yeah, there's shit for this route, yeah. <laughs> Lovely Daniel. Cool. 
Yeah, beep beep. And yeah, into uh, Floral Park Station. There's the main line there. Which I think realistic is now three tracks, but this is set in 2019, this bit. Here we are. It is weird seeing it in, in Train Sim, although it is cool seeing it on air as well. It's sort of one of those strange um, things where it's sort of a DLC first in Train Sim World, then it's gone to Train Simulator. A bit like the um, 187, the DBBR 187. I think quite a few people think that, Daniel. Well, there's a 6 and the 8's over here. There's also the M9, but there wasn't a lot of them in 2019 since they were just entering service in September. You'd probably still get it in, though. You've also got the diesel trains, haven't you? Is it like the DE30 and the DM30 on here? Oh, and you also get Long Island City as well, which is this bit here. Yeah, there's Long Island City. So you get that as well. Hunters Point Avenue there. Which is quite cool. And you've got Sunny, Sunny Side Yard there, which is the most jarring place to go into. As it's like five miles an hour right into it. Or well, really, really slow. Is New York Penn underground? Yes. Right, we've got a... Sort of a green on the signal there, so we can go through. Bella Rose next, which is like 700 yards from Floral Park. Is it not a third track? Rough. Oh, I see. It does look good. In fact, I'm going to take another screenshot. Pause the game and we can still move. There we go, let's take that. <laughs> Crazy dash. What does jarring mean? Uh, just irritating. Yeah, it's a sunny side yard. I remember uh, on the northeast corridor, New York, on trains and well coming into sunny side yard, it just felt so slow. It's a bit like going around the ring at Boston South. Just like, come on, get 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 round. Here we are. Yeah, the station signage is much better as well. And here we are. This is uh, Bella Rose Station. Lovely uh, 7.30. There we go. This is Bella Rose. So yeah, we're missing out Queen's Village, um, Hollis... Uh, and the hillside facility, Jamaica, uh, Kew Gardens, Forest Hills, Woodside. So we're all the way, we're fast all the way to New York, Penn. Uh, two level station has its lower level closed off. Yeah. And we wait. Minus 1,055. Awesome. Maybe in the next scenario we'll get positive points. Now there is that a guard buzzer. It's that thing, you press B for it. I'll do it at the next station. Well, that's the last one actually. And we're off. There's the passenger view again. As we uh, make our way out. Yes, yeah, so the difference on this from the train sim world version is as so, so yeah more detail to it um and it's set slightly more modern so in 20 well one half of the route's 2019 the other half's 2021 so this bit is 2019 this bit set 
whereas the Train Sim World version is probably a yeah, 2018. So it's slightly more modern on this version. I know I do keep comparing it and do keep mentioning Train Sim World, but we can't not. <laughs> we go. The lower level serves the J and Z lines and it's a normal station to take from that area but since the MTA um, plan to replace aging tracks and aging concrete on that station they are cut back. Alright. Jamaica Centre. Alright. Got ya. So I'm guessing you've been on this route a fair bit as well. Um, amazing. 80 miles an hour, most of the way into Jamaica now. I think it comes down to 45 once we come up towards Jamaica, or 35. I think 35. Well, it'll probably show us 40 or 30 on there. It is, it is a matter. That's why I like doing standard scenarios. Any more streams tonight? I uh, don't know yet. I mean, this one will be slightly longer, so I don't know. And can we try and get up to 30 likes? Thanks everyone for coming in. Hello Seitong, how are you? But yeah, there is a the pin message is the Steam link for this. So if you're liking what you're seeing, um yeah, it's on the Steam store now. Twenty four ninety nine. Forty pound no, thirty five pounds possibly. Which is a bit of a bargain, so you're saving yourself fifteen pounds buying the game and the route together. Hello Rashidi, how are you? There's Hollis Station. And you've got the hillside facility depot thingy here. And the station as well. Oh, running fairly well as well. Borderline smoothness. Evening Gordon, how are you? It comes down to 60. So we'll start bringing that down. There you go, that's now telling us to uh, start to come down. Down to 60. Where's St Albans? I think it's off that way, that line there. Yeah, beep, 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 beep to you too. Yeah, ooh, ooh, hello, ooh, it's not happy. Uh oh. It's all good, don't panic. Uh, beep, 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 yeah, there we go. Bring that down. There we go. Yeah, I think that goes off to St. Albans there. Hello, Lewis, how are you? Do the Fall Guys update. Is there a Fall Guys update? So we've got two warnings on there. So I don't really know. I, I sort of know the basics of Long Island Railroad signalling. I know that means red. And I know that's sort of a warning one. But we've got two warnings there. Isn't it called like Pennsylvania Railroad signaling? You've got also got it on Horseshoe Curve. Boston Sprinter ain't bad. In fact, Boston Sprinter is another route done by Brandon, who made this route as well. And there's Jamaica, which I believe the model of Jamaica was taken from Train Sim World. And down to 20. So I, when I look at that, I sort of think that as like a single yellow, almost. So you've got the red one at the top and then the single one underneath. Yeah, I know the basics of the signalling, so. Uh, I'm all good, uh, Sam. How much money is the new class 484 going to be? £15 for the 484. And remember, with the 484, you get the whole route as well, so. I mean, that is an absolute bargain. Oh, lovely Metro. Signalling on the Long Island Railroad is confusing, and once you play this more often, then you will get to see what the lining of the lights come up. Looks like we're going across here. 20 miles an hour. Across we go. Beep, 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 yes. There's another M7 over there. 
Let's go and play some power washing simulator. Lovely. You still don't get why they added St Albans and East Williston. I believe no electric trains even go to East Williston anymore. Um, well, I mean, I suppose it's just extra, isn't it? I mean, for making scenarios and stuff like that, you can make interesting things where you might go to St Albans for some reason. Just a little added bonus. Hey, Daniel, how are you? But yeah, if I ever go to New York, I'm definitely going to go on the Long Island Railroad. <laughs> and Metro North. A holiday full of travelling around New York. Hello Sam, how are you? This is Jamaica. There's the other M7 there. Oh, there's another M7 there going over the top. Look at that. Starting to see signs of life. Does it? Uh, smudge, come on, no, 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 no. Go on your chair. There she goes. Coming in on track. Well, actually, no, we're going through. I forgot we're not stopping here. I would have actually stopped it if I hadn't checked that again. Uh, the St Albans section heads to Far Rockaway, Long Reach branches, but it's mostly heading down to Babylon, in which they don't have in this game. You think Metro North is the best passenger route? It's just very, it is a nice one. Although, which one? Though? The Hudson Line, the New Haven Line, or the Harlem Line? I do like the uh, New York Third Rail routes. They are brilliant. Oh, you've got some colour lights as well here. Oh, I've just gone through Jamaica. I'm going to take another screenshot. There we go. Uh, Hudson, you get to see the ocean, or that would be the Hudson River, wouldn't it, while travelling at 80 miles an hour? Yeah, the, don't the electric trains go from Grand Central to Croton Harmon, isn't it? Probably Krasner. I was so tempted to get OMSI last night, or OMSI 2, but I don't know, just because the base map doesn't look great, and people say to get the London one, um, that's like £27. Uh, how was the voyage? <laughs> it was good. It was good, convoy. Very smooth. Yeah, I've seen some awesome images of it talk a lot. Well, that tone of horn there, that sounds like what we've got on the Harlem Line M7A on um, Train Sim World. More from the inside. And this one just sounds like the one we've got at the moment on Long Island. What's that, Gordon? Let's see. Cross and Harmon, electric trains, Pals Keep. Uh, Pal Ke Keep C diesel ones. I probably said that wrong. Pal Keep C. That's an interesting name. Pal Keep C. That's probably not how you say it. <laughs> Oh, about Omsi, don't get it. Uh, only if it, it, only get it if you're a big bus fan and must have it. Yeah, I've, I would have only got it for London, really, on there. Hello, Damien, how are you? So, yeah, that goes off to, well, the bit over there goes off to Atlantic Terminal. Hopefully, we'll do that in the next scenario. Uh, so, that will take you East New York, which is in the thumbnail of the, of the stream. And then Nostrand Avenue, and then Atlantic Terminal, which is the bit where it goes off uh, this way. That's quite it's like a weird section. It is sort of half it's, half of it's in a tunnel, and then the other half's on a bridge above. And it's really slow into Atlantic Terminal. Hello, Thomas. How are you? I'm not sure where these other bits go. 
I think that goes off to Long Island City, doesn't it? The Montauk branch track east. Doesn't that link up, like, round here somewhere? And what I have from crew on a pendo, awesome. Fair enough, Krazza. Up to 80. Yeah, more good Damien. Let's go. Yeah, so we're fast on this bit, missing out Kew Gardens, Forest Hills, uh, Woodside, and then well, New York Pen. And it's fairly quick as well, up to 80. And once we get to New York Pen, we'll see what the next scenario is. Goes to Fresh Pond Junction. And where does that then end up? Awesome, Krazza. The Jamaica Centre stations do have their own storage tracks once they do arrive at the station as the terminal. Uh, future extensions could come, but now they're just... Oh, uh, it's got, yeah. No sound. Oh, God. It, don't say the bloody thing's muted. <laughs> no, yeah, no, it should be sound. You should be able to hear it. Oh, I got you crazy. Okay, everyone hear it all right? You should be able to. <laughs> There's another service there on its way down. Lovely convoy. Let's get a fly by shot. It seems to be running alright actually. So I was looking at the preview stream last night. It seems to be about 15 FPS and I was like, oh no, but it actually seems to be running alright, so that's probably just on a preview build. <laughs> Better get the power off before it starts yelling at me. Sounds good, lovely. There's Forest Hills. Which seems to have a little extension there as well. Oh, the motors. Let's be fairly quiet, the train. Evening, Archer. How are you? Should we get another? Yeah, let's get another fly by shot. we got time. Just a long stretch now down towards Woodside. There it goes. I'm looking forward to seeing the New York skyline. Look really good uh, on the preview. You see like the Empire State Building. You can see it like, the whole lot. Fair enough, Damien. There's another M7. And yeah, on this train, the third row shoe uh, comes into contact with the third row on top. Whereas on the Metro North network, the third row shoe collects the power underneath the third row. So it's not really a shoe, is it? It's un underneath. <laughs> Oh, why's that archer? It's time to bugger off. There's a donkey on train some world on the side of the track on Long Island Railroad. That's one of the little Easter eggs then. What's that convoy? What what's the joke? It comes down to 60. But yeah, it's available now on the Steam store, 24.99. There we go. Let's do that. Now, even if you do have the Train Sim World version of this, still probably actually worth getting it on Train Simulator, just for the endless possibilities of running other trains on it and bits and bobs. Um, and also the way it is set slightly more modern. And also there's a bit more detail as well. So things you haven't seen on the TSW version you might see on this. You get the colour lights. Do you prefer the naked third row without the boards like in the southeast, or do you like it with the boards? Um, I prefer it as it is on here, Romella. How it is in the UK. Well, it's not too much of a difference, though, really. I 
Yeah, they, they should be on every dovetail route, Thomas. A little Easter egg they do. A little secret. I do like that little tone, though. I like that. No, there's no M3 in this. Although, same with Train Sim World, you don't get the M3 um, with the DLC. It's separate. So maybe in future we're seeing M3 for this route. Or maybe even one of the diesel locos. Now this is the bit I'm looking forward to seeing all of the skyline along here. You can already see, look at that. Is that the river over there as well? No. No, that, that's that's the roof of a warehouse. That's not the river. <laughs> I sort of looked at that and I was like, is that the river in the distance? But no, it's just a warehouse roof. Oh dear. There we go. There's another train up there. There's the northeast corridor there. Oh, that's too crazy. <laughs> that's how you've done their uh, convoy. Yeah, this is the bit I'm looking forward to seeing. In a minute, we should see the whole New York skyline just in front of us. And that is going to be nice to see. See a few more buildings starting to come in now. So I think this area, well, you've got the sunny side yard down there, but isn't this called Harold round here? But have I been on this route? No. It does. So that's the... I'm guessing that's probably the east side access tunnel, so that takes you to Grand Central. being careful. I'm seeing signals I haven't seen. Oh, well, that one's alright. Smudge, no. Come on, man, you get back on the chair. There you go. Off we go. Yeah, beep, beep. Got ya. I don't think we have any red signals as we are running a little bit late. Just, just a tad. So in a minute we go in the East River Tunnel, which takes us, um, well, under the East River. Cool. I see Archer. Ever been to the US? No. Let's see you've done there, uh, convoy. Although, no, no need for caps, though. <laughs> Got 40 on there. It comes down to 45 anyway. So, yeah, over there you've got Hunter's Point Avenue, then that then takes you to Long Island City. Although, we're going under here and into the tunnel. Yeah, beep, 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 yes. What I'll do, actually, I'm going to fly up and we can see the skyline. Oh, there it is, there. You can see, the, now you can see the river as well. There's the Empire State Building there. Awesome. Um... Maybe I need to fly slightly further. Probably actually hasn't rendered it. Oh, no, there we go. I can see it for a sec. There. Just at the right corner there, you can see the One World Trade Center. There it is there. What's the best way to see it? Maybe fly a bit further. No, I just... There. there. There it is. There's the One World Trade Center and all the buildings around there. Right, let's speed up. Arch Avenue Shop. Ah. That's like a maintenance thing, isn't it? And... Even Davidoff, that's all good. This looks really good as well, going through the tunnel here. Hello, Smudge. Yep, hello. I'll let her out in a second. This looks really good in here. Knocking things over. It's actually quite dark. 
<laughs> nah, I got your mana. Cool, yeah, we'll do another scenario after this, and we'll try and get down to Atl Atlantic Terminal. There's an update on the Great Western route. What, a new one? Or, I mean, a while back, there was a couple of weeks ago, there was. I'll get the cab light on so you guys can see slightly easier. Actually, it doesn't make too much of a difference. Nah, keep it off. Oh, yes, case. Cool. No, yeah, it does look good. Uh, are there any differences in this version and Train Some World what version? Well, one thing you can see right now is the tunnel go the East River Tunnel looks way better on the um, Train Sim version. Similar to how the Harlem Line Tunnel looks on um, Train Sim World, which is much darker and much better baked, and it just looks better, more realistic. And there's more detail on this one as well, Luna. Yeah, more detail. And you get East Williston and St Albans as like a little bonus. One on the Oyster Bay branch and one on the Montauk branch. Get that up. There we go. Not too far uh, until Penn Station. Yeah, beep, 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 yeah. Yeah, coming down. Hang on, it's not bringing us right now. There we go. <laughs> We're all good. We just coast it. There's the passenger view. Well, let's bring us. Whoa, 15, yeah, don't panic. Yeah, we're all good, we're all good. I seem to want us to go at 15 already. I'll get that one to you guys can see. Really slow into New York pen. Here we go though. Give it a minimum power. Should be alright. See a green up there. Is it picking up the opposite side signals? I think it is, isn't it? It is picking up the um the other signals on the other side on there. And actually, now I think this was actually a thing um, on the preview stream last night. Brandon said that there was a bug where it brings you down to 15 really early coming into New York Penn. So that's probably what we've got here. Perhaps Jamie last night was on the other tunnel on this side. That's who's done that as well, convoy. We're not yet, dabbed off. They're still voting. We're good. Not smudge again, come on. Off. Back onto your chair. Go on. There we go. She clicks the key on the keyboard, it's all over. That'd be the train break or something. Just in the windows open, just go out the window. And this is New York Pen we are coming into. Beep, beep, yeah. Beep, beep, again. What track? Track 19. Is that going to be the far one? Alright. That was a nice journey, though. Up from uh, Hempstead. Yeah, we'll do another scenario and try and get down the Atlantic Terminal branch or even Hicksville or even Belmont Park if we can can you show St Albans I'm sure we can spawn in there at the end if you remind me not today Davidoff <laughs> I'm 
sure was Smudge. Oh, I think she's going back around again. Lap four, possibly. All right, is there a stop marker for us? Uh, is that a fourteen car unit? I suppose it's four fourteen. Bloody hell! It's a long train. I suppose that's probably not. That's probably one of the diesels, isn't it? Yeah, not bad. Did I miss our stop marker? No. This looks good as well. And there, this is New York. We made it. Here we are. So Grand Central, I think, is up there, isn't it? Slightly further up. Excellent work, engineer. That was a nice run. This train that will now run back to Jamaica to continue its day. Lovely. Uh, if I, oh, there's West Side Yard as well. And that's West Side Yard there. And you've got the um, the high line which goes up here into uh, into New York, which is quite cool to see. And yeah, there's the One World Trade over there. Right, there we go. Let's um, come out of there. Right, let's see. A uh, career. Let's do what we got. Hicksville to Hillside Yard. That wouldn't be too bad. Well, that looks like it's going to be a dark one. Uh, Jamaica to Hempstead early in the morning. Anything to Atlantic Terminal? Um, surely. Atlantic Terminal to Hicksville. That's perfect. Oh, that, oh, that's quite late, that is. It's going to be pitch black. What's here? What we got? Summer of Hell. Um, from Hicksville towards New York Penn, New York Penn to Hicksville. Um, mm, what should we do? Um, that won't be too bad. From Hicksville towards New York Penn. Well, if we took that one from New York Penn to Jamaica, then we've covered that section. And then, no, we'll do this, and we'll take it to Jamaica, and then we'll do, yeah, then we can cover most of the track. Let's do um let's do that one. And we'll take it as far as Jamaica and then we'll come out of that one and go into the one which will then goes from Atlantic Terminal to Jamaica. And then we've seen all of it apart from the Belmont Park bit. Right, good morning engineer. Set up the train uh, for ready to, uh, departure from Hicksville. Please do not allow passengers oh do not forget to allow passengers to board here. This train would normally have come from Huntington, but a tree is blocking the line. Come from the East Coast Main Line. A train a line between here and there due to an earlier thunderstorm. Passengers are being bussed from Hicksville to Huntington and not very happy. I mean, I'm not surprised. Right, let's get this set up. Uh, do that to that. Um, fair enough, crazy. Um, yes, beep. That's a max, that's a forward, uh, instrument lights on, and then we'll charge the brakes. Let's do that. There you go, they're being charged. As we load up people here. Yeah, so we'll take this as far as Jamaica, and then we'll come out of this one and go into the one from Atlantic Terminal, and then take that as far as Jamaica. So we've got Westbury, Cold Place, Manola, Maryland Avenue, New Hyde Park, and then Jamaica. So we are going um, most of the way. Seems to actually take us into Long Island City. But we're only going as far as Jamaica. Cool. On this stormy day here at Hicksville. Let's uh, go ahead. Cool. So from here to Jamaica it is around um, half an hour-ish. Not bad though, is it? Not bad at all. Good stuff. Just waiting for departure now. Looks like we are a 12 coach train. Hang on, no, we're more than that. Two, four, six, eight. 10, oh no we are 12 
Yeah. Uh, our timings are as followed. Um, Westbury at 20 hours is the times of when we're due to the place. Right, let's get going. Actually, let's do the uh, buzzer. There you go. And let's go. Westbury next. Sounds quite good, doesn't it? Give yeah, external noise. Cool. Lovely. Sounds good, doesn't it? In. There's the passenger view again, so it's like we're going backwards this time on the uh, on the view. Not speeding, of course. No, don't speed. Bring that down. Well, that's just 80 on there. Was 30? Oh, there we go. Now we can get that up. And up we go, let's get out to 100% power. So we are a slow service to Jamaica. Uh, the only places we aren't calling at are Floral Park, Queens Village, Hollis, and I suppose Hillside as well. Let's go. I do love the uh, New York Third Rail routes though, they're always great. Always very enjoyable. What's happened to chat's died? <laughs> Get that up. Can't open the window on here, I don't think. Not too far to Westbury. At 80 as well. Let's um, coast that. There we go. We get a quick flyby shot as well before we come up to the station. As I don't really want to be flying through the station at 80 miles an hour. It's lovely, isn't it, Meta? Get back in. But yeah, if you do enjoy your third rail British routes, I do recommend trying out um, the sort of New York um, third rail ones, so the Hudson Line, Long Island Railroad, the Harlem Line on Train Sim World. You probably actually will end up enjoying them. Let's get the third rail, electric multiple units, British place names, so um, they're quite enjoyable. Here we are. Just got. I mean, the brakes on here are immense. I mean, this is minimum brake. Look how fast that's coming down. Let's get an external arrival. So, no matter how do the sounds compare to real life? I'm guessing by the looks of things, or by the sounds of things, very good. I thought they might not open. Albans. <laughs> hey Archer, thanks for the one pound fifty, mate. Much appreciated. I like the new sort of super chat, sort of the way it looks. 
But yeah, much appreciated, Archer. Archer does have his own channel, and he does flight sim and stuff over there, so if that's your kind of thing, go and have a look. Fair enough, crazy. We got positive points. Yes. Car place next. Waiting for the uh, guard. Oh, I do it. There we go. Right, let's go. Maybe we don't have a guard on this one. <laughs> a bit of light, yeah. Uh, we have driven the Shinkansen before. We did it on the. It was new. It was the Just Trains line, the Tohoku High Speed and Regional lines. Back in January time. February time we did uh, the Shinkansen. I did think it was going to be more. I mean, it is impressive the Shinkansen, but I thought it was going to be more than three and two hundred miles an hour. It was just like I want to go to three hundred. I thought these things went hot faster. Oh, pretty cool though. Oh, hello, Smudge. Yes, hello again. She's back. Down. I did say I was going to let you out, didn't I? Here she is again. Hello. It's a nice, comfy chair. Oh no, she's like, no, I'm not going on the chair. No, not not on the screen. Well, there we go. Let's smudge again. Welcome back, NG. <laughs> yeah, me too, Daniel. I thought they went much quicker. Hello, Ben. How are you? So, when are you next on the Long Island Railroad, de Miller? That'd be quite cool, Miller, getting clips of um, the Long Island in real life and then sort of doing that like, comparison. Hello RDY, how are you? What's the difference between Train Sim 2022 and Train Sim Classic? Well, Train Sim Classic um, is is Train Sim 2022 pretty much. Well, Train Sim 2022 became Train Sim Classic, so they're the same thing. Um, well, yeah, Train Sim 22 became Train Sim Classic. You having a fancy lovely Ben? Hello Thomas. That's pretty much all there is to it. <laughs> so if you've got Train Sim 2022 still, make sure you've updated the game. And it should convert to TSC. Oh lovely munchies. Let's go. Mine Ola next or Mini Ola? I'm going to be very dangerous and go and let Smudge out whilst we're driving. Hold on a sec. Otherwise she's going to be scratching at the door and all. Hold on. Right, Smudge is out. Let's hope none of the alarms have gone off. I hope we're still in one piece. So I think we're all good. There you go. And once we get to Minneota, we'll fly up to East Williston and we'll have a look at that. Awesome, uh, RD. Well, if you want to get this route with it, there's actually a bundle. Uh, I think it's like the US Deluxe Edition. £35, I think. And you get Train Sim Classic with this route. So you're saving 50 Was it 25 No, it might be 30 So you're saving like 15 quid. Uh, not in the end, NG, no. Awesome, Amela. The Babylon branch. Uh, it should be Davidoff, yes. Was it far too many, Ola? Anyway, I'll fly up the Oyster Bay for a little bit. 
What's the Oyster Bay branch like? I don't know if you've been on it. Is it scenic? That down. Cool. Because uh, you give me a flight to do Gatwick to Innsbruck. That's about an hour and forty minutes. If it lets us, we'll fly up to East Williston. Most near the end. Where's that go? I'm guessing. Is that Greenwood, that one? Where it goes to? Well, I guess probably Oyster Bay. <laughs> In the name. I just thought that one might be going up that way. What comes with the basic sim in terms of UK content? Um. You get the West Coast Main Line south, so that's about 110 miles between Euston and Birmingham New Street. Uh, that's all you get in the base package, I believe. And then the other routes you get are the Barnstrecker Dresden to Leipzig and the Tehachapi Pass. That's where you get in the sort of base for it. Oh, green box on that one. Hello, Chris. How are you? Right, let's try and find East Williston. I think it's off this way. Hopefully, it might not let us fly all the way there. Oh, here it is. This is East Williston Station. So this is also included with um, with this. Oh, and then there's the buffers there. So this will be good for scenarios and stuff on the workshop. You'll probably see some starting from there. I was already right. Maryland Avenue next. Let's go. Awesome, Thomas. Good luck. Oh, lovely, uh, Ben. Awesome. Yeah, good to hear, Chris. I'm all good. In fact, we'll take this as far as... No, we will do it to Jamaica. No, we'll take it to Floral Park. As we've already seen the Jamaica bit, so... Oh, I see it, man. I got you. Unelectrified past Babylon. And we're off. <laughs> Did you see my last comment? Probably not Davidoff, so what do I say? Put it again if I don't see it. Oh no, I already said no, I didn't get it. Well, this is Maryland Avenue. Here we are. Cool. I think it's about 15 quid, Brandon, I believe. If not, have a look at AP's website. Have you downloaded it through the launcher? And have you got the Chatham Mainline? Because you have to have the chat the Chatham Mainline for it to work. And I think it may be the old Chatham Mainline. It's not the Chatham and Medway Valley. The actual just Chatham Mainline, the old one. Well, that might you might not need that one. Hello, William. How are you? It should say the requirements in the description for it. Well, I mean, if your name's Flying Scotsman, then yeah, <laughs> you'll probably enjoy it. Was a march? It's a nice flight. We've done it before, though. It crashed right towards the end, which was annoying. And 
New Hyde Park next. Hmm, D E D M engine. Is that where the diesel trains would then change to third rail or put the shoe down? There's another M7. Yeah, we'll take it as far as Floral Park and then we're going to the next scenario, which will take us from Atlantic Terminal to Jamaica. Uh, not too sure, Davidoff. Uh, not sure. Oh, that's a stop marker for diesel trains. Alright. Ah, Can they be longer than 12 coaches? Are they always busy or fairly quiet? On we go. I do like that tone though. Right, let's start popping that down. There you go, that's coming down. And I believe Train Sim's live tonight, so after this I might try and redirect the stream over there. Yeah, depending on what time we end, do stick around and it will automatically send you over to uh, the Train Sim channel. Well, I believe Jamie's going to be showing off this route as well. Uh, I would imagine so crazy. Well, that's the track speed, I think. Yeah, that's the track speed there. And I believe I have access turned on. We are. Here we are. I did, yeah, not good, was it, David? Off. When am I using my will next? I don't know. When we play a game, what needs the will? That's a short platform at this one. And cool thing about train sim is the doors don't open; <laughs> they actually stay shut, and the ones on the platform open. Lovely bent. Um, Amela, what was the requirements for the 377-375 EP pack? Again. Is it the, it's the old Chatham mainland, isn't it? Or can it be the Chatham and Medway Valley? And yeah, Brandon's got it, but he's um, having problems trying to get it in. Off we go. You're playing full guys, what's my opinion on it? It's a fun game. Bit of fun, isn't it? Actually, you know what? We will take it to Jamaica. Might as well. Yeah, which one do you actually need for the 375 EP? I know I just had the chat and mainline. And have the other one. Well, I don't think it's really a place to be discussing it here, Davidoff. I suppose. Yeah, have a look at the post, mate. Off we go. And then we come up on Floral Park again. Very long train. There's the driver at the back, or it might be the conductor. Through Floral Park. Then you get the Hempstead branch, which comes up. I also fly down to Belmont Park, then we can see that. 
Do that train some mild or some Thomas. Right, let's hope nothing goes off. I'm going to fly over to... Um, actually, no, not just yet. Do it in a sec. I'll fly over to Belmont Park, then you can see that. And we'll also fly over to St Albans as well. Tiny look, aren't Cool. Then you got Queen's Village coming up, even in Para. Looks like multiplayer watch here. I think Gordon was on that. You could hook up with him on there. Around the container as well. So this is Belmont Park here. You can actually the whole race course here. Yeah, this is Belmont Park Station. It's a bit of a weird station. Looks like that platform's not used anymore by the looks of things. Yeah, Belmont Park. Lovely William. This is Queen's Village. Which looks like it may have no, looked like it might have added a little extension. On we go. Yeah, big thanks again to Dovetail for giving us a um, key to show this off to you guys. Hopefully everyone is uh, enjoying it. There's a passenger view. Get that back. I thought we might go onto the um, slow line. No, into the fast line. That's why I bring it down, but we didn't in the end. Awesome power. That's Hollis next. There's another M7 coming up. Can't wait for the full right foot. It's going to be good, isn't it, Ben? It's going to be good. Yeah, it's alright, isn't it, William? That's another long one as well. Look at that. Wow. Put that down. Cool. This is Hollis. Another sort of small platform. That's Hillside next. You find the collectibles on Steam. Alright. Oh yeah, Jamaica will flick over to the other scenario. Uh, which takes us from Atlantic Terminal and we'll go as far as Jamaica. Cool. Beep, beep, beep. Yeah, don't worry. Down to 70. <laughs> Lovely, William. Yeah, it's a bit of good fun. That wants us to come down even more soon. Beep, beep, yeah, don't worry, don't panic. So yeah, a couple of bugs I've noticed. It does seem, I think it picks up signals from the other direction. Another one was the 15 miles an hour into New York Penn. Or like from way before. Cool. Oh, it does look very good. Comes down to 20 soon as well. 20 again. <coughs> Apologies again, everyone. <laughs> I 
I tried going for the mic. I tried going for the mic again, but that one's all good. Right, we're down to twenty. Oh, well, let's fly over to uh, St Albans. He might not actually let us take go over, fly over that far. We might have missed the uh, opportunity. I think it's over that way, St Albans. Let's have a look. Yeah, St Albans is down there. Lovely archer. How many buttons is there to set up on there? How long does it actually take to get going? So it's about 20 minutes or 15 minutes in sort of the base A320. Is that the NG? Did you see my last comment? What was your last comment? Yeah, well, we, we don't need to know that double off, mate. That's yeah, not, not suitable for chat, really. You like the M7? Nice, Thomas. Yeah, this is Jamaica. Hello, Mason. How are you? Good stuff. Seems like we have to go. No, we don't have to go past the platform. Oh god! External cam. It's all good. There we go. Right, let's come out of there, and we are going to do the scenario where we see the Atlantic terminal. So we do Atlantic Terminal to Hempstead. I hope it doesn't crash, as that's a couple of scenarios we've loaded into now. Uh, which one was it? That's the one. It might crash, so we might have to load back in. So we've loaded into quite a bit, so... But it might work. It's a nice train, the M7. Oh, we're starting in the yard, are we? Set up the train, it's like Vanda something yard. Oh, we'll set it up quick. Um, do that, yes. So that's a max, that's a forward, smudge his back, so he's going to make a whole racket. Hello. Right, so we we'll get this set up, and then we'll take it into Atlantic Terminal, and then take it back towards Jamaica. Cool. Let's try to start the redirect. There you go, that's that. Uh, set that to bright. Get them off. Probably, um, yeah, we're just in here. That seems you can go in now that way. I thought you had to, unless this is a new bit here, I thought you had to go from there. I thought you had to go to there and then reverse back to there and then into there. But it seems you can go straight in now that way. Maybe it was always like that, just never noticed. Or is this a new tunnel, a new way in? Cool. Uh, yeah, it's a bit more detail on this one, I'd say. Oh, blimey. <laughs> Little bit, then. I say it's very more detail on here, and this one's also slightly more modern. I think it's like a Vanderbilt yard or something, or Vanderbilt yard. Let's have a look. Just this VD. It's very slow into Atlantic Terminal. Wake up, everyone. Let's 
Through we go. Track three at Atlantic Terminal. Hey, there's Brandon. How you doing, mate? But yeah, this is Brandon. So, can we have some hellos in the chat? Brandon is the uh, developer of this route. Yeah, was this track always here then, this bit here? Because I'm pretty certain on Trains in World, which was set in 2018, to get into this yard you had to go to like here and then reverse in and then go back into there. Maybe I'm just completely forgetting this bit was here. There we go. Oh, we're speeding. Fire mum's awesome. Uh, it's brilliant. Oh, the yard was reconfigured in recent years. Got ya. See, this station is probably the most irritating station to drive into. Just in general, on the Trains in Wild one, on here, probably even in real life, it's five miles an hour. Can't wait for the 484, awesome. Also downhill as well. We are going to get minus points. Let me get that on so you guys can see a bit more. It's just so tempting just to speed into it. Then after that we are going to be stopping at, um, oh, we're not stopping at Nostrand Avenue, so it's East New York and then Jamaica. And at Jamaica we'll end there, as so then we've seen every bit of track there is. That is, yeah. And also by the time we get to Jamaica it should be time for the train simulator stream to start. So it should send you over there. Yeah, so we'll go as far as Jamaica on this one. And we go. Let's let it speed. The station actually starts sloping like a bowl once you hit the platform, but that can't be replicated in Trains um Classic because of a bug, so I had to keep it at a constant 1.3% grade. Ah. That was speeding again. God. It's a nice cab, isn't it, Mason? Here's a nice cab. All the little details there for the subway connections. Like that. Yeah, there's definitely more detail on this one to what there is on TSW. All the signage and stuff. It's, um, yeah. Much more detail. That's how far away it's going off. It does, doesn't it? The brakes are squealing. There almost. Almost there, almost there. And here we are. That would do. Right, let's get the doors open. Uh, we shall put that to off. Uh, marker lights on. Instrument lights off. Uh, set that to. Max, key out, emergency, that goes to off, and then change ends. Yeah, that must, that should be the other side. There we go. Uh, Michael lights off, key in, set that to max, forward, instrument lights, charge brakes. Charge them up. There we go, uh, charge in. I don't know when we're due out of here, I'm guessing probably 33 past. And then we're straight to East New York. Which is quite a sort of cool section, the next one, as half of it's on top of a bridge, sort of above the road. And then the second half, you sort of, it's vice versa, so the road goes above and the railway goes underneath. So you're sort of in a tunnel. 
And you've got Nostrand Avenue here, which we're not stopping at. Yeah, so you're on a bridge pretty much most of the way to, I think, this portal here. And then you then go into the tunnel into East New York, and then you're in a tunnel most of the way to, um, to sort of, to Jamaica. Bowden's Landing Track. Is that a new station? Must be. I've never seen that one before, unless that's another staff station. Oh, yes, well, we do. And then into Jamaica, which is over there. Doesn't really matter. This one's in the dark because, well, half of it will be in a tunnel. Prove there we go. Right, East New York next. No, not, not that way. That way. No, hang on, hang on. No, 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 no. I'm not going into the buffer. Go. <laughs> there. I was an employee only stop. Well, it should be slightly easier to uh, maintain five. Unless it would be harder to speed. Bones Land is it oh it isn't train somewhere. Is it the order of the turntable? It's for them diesel trains. Start taxi into runway twenty six left. One hour forty cruising at three seventy. Lovely. Oh, I say I say it's gonna be easier not to speed. And what do we do? We speed. Uh, that's a good point, Luke. Yeah, they haven't done, uh, haven't mentioned anything since Horseshoe, have they? Which was in April, I think. So, yeah, they might be working our way on something. Or working on the 187 fix. So, we're going straight on now. Still five miles an hour. Why is it five going out, though? out in a second you can see where it starts to go up there and it sort of curls up it's a really steep grade curling up into uh, Nostrand Avenue very steep I think it comes down to 30 miles an hour as well I don't know in terms of ratio what the grade is but it's steep Probably near enough a one in thirty or so. Cool. But yeah, do wait around until the end, because um, well, it depends what time this ends. Uh, we'll try and redirect the stream over to um, the train simulator one. So for continue Long Island action. See you, Brandon. Thanks for coming in, mate. <laughs> you too. I shall be over to the preview. Well, the launch day stream after this. Hello Neil, how are you as well? So tempting just to go up to 45 now. What time were you into Jamaica? We're into Jamaica at 54. So still about 20 minutes. So we should end bang on when the TS stream starts. Hello David, how are you? So I'll make sure it redirects over to that. So you don't have to click any buttons. It'll just take you over there after. So tempting just to speed up. And David, I'll probably be down on Wednesday now. Next Wednesday. Good here, uh, Neil. Haven't got this route yet. Alright. What do you think of it? So far. Sort of from what you've seen and screenshots and stuff. Let's 
so close. And that back part will be um, past the 45. Almost, and then we can speed up. It is painful going at 5 out of here. Uh, next Wednesday I'll be down, David, probably to the Isle of Wight. Unfortunately, didn't end up going today. Right, let's go. Full whack. You hear, you hear all the passengers going, yes, and celebrating in the back as soon as they just feel that the speed increasing of that really slow bit. Let's go. Awesome, uh, Neil. Oh, what? What have I done? I've upset it. Oh, it says 45 on there and 70. So I don't know why it would be thinking about 30. I think it's thinking it's. No, there you go, we're going up now. There we go. Cool. How far to East New York? We've got three miles to East New York. Put that down. There we go. And you get the very steep grade up onto into Nostrand Avenue. Yes. Okay, now it actually has come down to 40. And down to 30 in a second as well. The 70 is similar to 80, it just enforces signal limits. Don't panic, don't panic. Yes, we're down to 30. This is very steep coming out of here. I'll get the cab lot on so you guys can see slightly better. Although we won't be overground for long as we'll be going back underground fairly soon. Yeah, very steep out of uh, out of here. This is Nostrand Avenue, which we are not stopping at. Here we go. Get that up now. Up to 45. Well, not too long, we'll be back into the tunnel. So it doesn't really matter that it's uh, night time. I assume we'll be in the tunnel anyway. But down. But it's very, very detailed. Hence the way it's slightly lower FPS. So we go back down into the tunnel, and the road then goes above us. Let's wake everyone up. Put your passenger view as well. What about Armstrong, bud? So then you'll see the road come up in a second, it will ramp up and then we go sort of down. You can actually see where we go back into the tunnel. The East New York station is quite a cool one. That's the one in the um, thumbnail. But yeah, straight after this it will take you over to the train simulator stream, which will be starting in around 12 minutes time. That's one we should get to Jamaica as well. So, um, wakey wakey. This will be bang on.
Then we go into the tunnel. Into East New York coming up. There we go. <laughs> Do you mind you vote me up? Have it. And we've had over 2,000 people come in, so thanks all for uh, coming in this evening. I want to say a big thanks to Dovetail Games for giving us access to uh, show this off. Hello, Robert. How are you? How are we finding it? It's been good so far. Much more detailed over the... Um, well, much more detail over the TSW version. I'll say that. That's for sure. And obviously more modern as well, which is nice. At East New York, the New York City subway L train is right at the top. Oh, all right, so it's like a double-decker station. I thought it was the road atop. This is East New York. It's quite an intriguing station, but the way it is. Especially if it's like a double-decker uh, station as well. Of uh, another train above. East New York. Has anyone picked this route up so far? And if so, how are you finding it? Here we are. Let's have a look. Oh. Would you mean it would be underneath a mellow or? Yeah, there's the road there. So is it maybe underneath the subway? Cool though. And we're waiting here until 45, so we arrived on time. That doesn't happen very often. Cool. So yeah, we'll take it as far as Jamaica, and then that will be it. Then the train simulator stream begins. So plenty of Long Island action. Yeah, it's been good, Mason. There you go. And you also have the guard buzzer go off as well. Which we might hear. It's very quiet. There. I'll see a matter. In real life, there's the L train right on top of this line. Ah. And into the tunnel. See ya, Ben. Thanks for coming in. We are off. Just waiting for train sim to go live, and I can then uh, send. Um, oh, there's a new Rivet Games video as well. That'll be good. I'll watch that after this, as well as the preview or the launch stream. Up to 70 as well. So slightly quicker. Yes, beep beep. Hey, welcome back, Amanda. How are you now? Yep, see ya, Amanda. Thanks. Oh, whoa, hello. Beep, beep, beep. I think it's going all colourful. What's going on? That's why it's a 60. The train gets angry fairly quickly. Not as angry as PZB, though. Lovely. So, to Jamaica, we have got four miles. And most of the journey is in the tunnel. Sort of the weird part of this section. Half of it's on a bridge, and then the other half's in a tunnel to uh, Jamaica. So yeah, we've pretty, we have seen every single bit of track. We flew up to East Williston. Uh, we flew most of the way down to St Albans. Um, we didn't look at Long Island City. That's one place we haven't. But yeah, you can see the route map there. So you see the bonus area, so you get East Williston there where the cursor is, and St Albans there. On we go. Eight coaches long. 
I do like that tone of horn though. That sounds very much like the um, the M7A horn on the hard one line for TSW. And that's pretty much how the Long Island one sounds at the moment on TSW. Hard on line, Long Island. <laughs> Hello again, Thomas. Cool. So we're due there in, what's well, two miles? We're due there at 54. 54? We must have to wait for another train. Surely, 54. I mean, that's still six minutes away to go two and a half miles. Might be a red coming up at some point. There's actually a train there at the moment in R1, so that's probably why. Train to Atlantic Terminal. Yeah, that's probably the one um, stopping us. Hello, Janos, how are you? Cool. It's been nice, though. It's been nice seeing it in, um, in train sim. So yeah, we've had this route for three and a half years, well, almost four years now on Train Sim World, so it is nice to see it on here. See how it compares. And it comes down to 45, then down to 30, then down to 20. Yes, beep, 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 colourful lights, everything's flashing. It wants us to come down to 40. Let's do that. There we go. There's the other train. That's all good, uh, Janos. Yes, beep, 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 beep. Yes, yes, yes. There we go. up here. Lovely. There's a little staff stop there as you come out of the uh, tunnel. Yes, beep beep. There's another M7. There we go. Got a warning there on that signal. As we yeah, as we come into Jamaica. Oh, that's that going off again. Was it one of the fifteen? Okay, maybe it will be fifty four, we'll be there. Very slow. There. Cool. Yeah, so in about three minutes we get to Jamaica, and in three minutes the Real Fan TV stream starts. So perfect. And it should redirect you over there once this is done. That's not for us, is it? Enough for the line up there. <laughs> it kept beeping, yeah. There's another M7 as well. M7's everywhere. Cool. Well, there's a road down there as well, look at that. And underneath us, as the track goes above us. That one goes up towards New York Penn. Yeah, there we are. Cool. And then to Jamaica.
a little bit of mo a little bit of throttle, just to welly us in there. No, we're not on the track. I thought we'd be on. I thought we'd be on the track there to the uh, right. almost there and that will then be it hopefully everyone has enjoyed it obviously big thanks to dovetail games for giving us the key to show it off and hopefully yeah, hopefully everyone has enjoyed it that was the long island railroad which is out now on the steam store for train some classic for 24.99 Be right to the end. Let's try not to go for a red light now. That'll do. There we go. Well, that is going to be it, everyone. Hopefully, everyone has enjoyed that. Uh, it should send you over to the Railfan TV stream once this is done, which is pretty much now. Uh, links can be found in the description to the Discord server, to the PayPal, and to the merch store if you do want to help support the channel. But yeah, that was the Long Island Railroad on Train Sim Classic, available now, $24.99 on the Steam store. Definitely worth checking out if you've never seen the Long Island Railroad before. Even if you've got the Train Sim World version, probably still worth checking out because it's slightly more detailed and slightly more modern as well. But apart from that, thanks all for coming in, and I hope to see you in the next one. See you all. Take care. Bye, guys.